Welcome to our Angular development series. Today, we're tackling a tricky issue that many developers encounter when working with forms. Our viewer has a question about a template-based form in their Angular 2 app, specifically regarding the behavior of the form after using the reset function. They want to know why their form fields become invalid after calling form.reset following a successful submission. Let's dive into the details and find out how to resolve this issue. Welcome back guys to another technical help question. I'll be going through the question, the answers, and hoping to help find that answer. Guys, I hope you stay crazy just a little bit like me and get through and work to the solution. Now let's get started. The issue you're facing occurs because when you call form.reset, it resets the form state, including its validity. This means that after a successful submission, the form fields are marked as pristine and invalid. To fix this, you can manually set the form's validity after resetting it. One approach is to use the set errors method to clear any errors on the form after the reset. Here's how you can modify your on sign up form submit function. After calling form.reset, add form.setErrors null to ensure the form is valid after resetting. This way, when you reset the form, it will not revert to an invalid state and your form will be ready for new input without showing validation errors. Let's now look at a user-suggested answer. To fix the issue of the form becoming invalid after calling form.reset in Angular, the user suggests resetting the form and clearing the errors for all controls. This ensures that the form is ready for new input. Let's now look at another user-suggested answer. To fix the issue of an invalid form after using form.reset in Angular, simply initialize a new model for the form and set submitted to false. Let's now look at another user-suggested answer. To prevent your form from becoming invalid after using form.reset in Angular, change the button type from submit to button. This ensures the form does not trigger a submit action when clicked. Let's now look at another user-suggested answer. To fix the issue of the form becoming invalid after using form.reset in Angular, a simple JavaScript solution is recommended. You can reset the form using the reset method on the form element. Let's now look at another user-suggested answer. In Angular 5, to handle form resets effectively, create a form group named First Form Group. If you're not using form groups, 
you can use a template-driven form with MyInform. In your HTML, include a button that calls a clear form method while preventing the default submission behavior. This is crucial to ensure that validators reset properly after the form is cleared. It's common for validators to remain active after a reset, making the form look inconsistent. To avoid this, ensure your button is outside the form or prevent submission when it's inside. Remember, calling event.preventDefault is key to achieving this. And that's it guys. I hope that's found the answer that you're looking for and you got through to that solution. If you did, please hit the subscribe button. I'd really appreciate it. And until the next time, you have a technical issue, I'll see ya. Have a good one.